in Baldur's Gate and you have those druids in Act 1, like the very beginning of the story, and they're all like, oh, we don't want these tieflings here, like they could just go die on the road kind of thing, like if they're going to go march against the goblins or whatever, we just don't want them here, and it's the natural order of things, whatever. And a lot of people are like, man, these druids, they're so, they're so trash and all that kind of stuff. And that got me thinking about like druids in general. If a druid isn't just a vegetarian, they're a monster. That druid is straight up a monster. Now you can try to argue, well, what about the natural order of things? The druids just understand purely the natural order that you can eat meat, you eat other creatures because what you do to survive. But we can eat meat because we can't talk to it. We can't talk to the creatures. If we were talking to these creatures and they were begging for their lives and they were asking us not to eat them and we did it anyways, we're monsters. We are the baddies. So you have these, this whole group of people who are able to speak with animals or able to help animals out. And if they're not just vegetarians, they are just absolutely brutal. And it makes sense. Suddenly it all clicks why they treat the tieflings this way, why they treat outsiders this way, because they are just okay killing and eating anyone who talks to them. They don't care. It's just the natural order of things. So really the only druids who are probably like super chill and nice people probably don't eat meat. 